Hey, That's Joseph, okay. for folks coming home after their holidays, they're coming into a little bit of snow, depending on where they are, right? Yeah, depending on where they're traveling. If they're going over the pass, they're definitely going to come across that. It's a little slow moving up there, as it should be, because the snow has been coming down for quite some time. 46 degrees right now coming out of Vancouver. We've had a few breaks in between these showers, but more showers likely over the next couple of hours for our evening. You can see 26 degrees right there from Mount Hood Meadows. We'll zoom on into the Riverview Community Bank camera. You can see the clouds in the distance, Mount Hood Meadows. Snow's coming down there. A little breezy, kind of hard to see through there, but uh, definitely snowy scene. And 37 degrees come of our Skamania Lodge camera where it's green, it's a little wet, it's raining there, and 49 degrees with some sunshine there for the coast. So a little bit of everything today, right? Snow, some sunshine, a nice sunset, and a little bit of rain. Okay, let's carry on. We do have a look at our weather headlines. This is what you can expect over the next day or so and approaching the weekend. We are going to have some more mountain snowfall that will continue overnight. I expect maybe a few more inches. So if you still have plans to travel through the passes, uh, you're going to want to really check on in and check out some of those ODOT uh, cameras because it's going to be a little bit slower. Some scattered showers uh, at times might be a bit heavy for this evening, uh, but there's going to be some drier weather and that's going to be a, a likely through parts of our Thursday afternoon. And then uh, depending on where we're at, we'll have some dry weather on Friday as well. OK, you can see the snowfall off to the east. You can see the snowfall here in the northern uh, Cascades in Oregon and then those scattered showers there and maybe even some snowfall there for some locations in the coast range, not down to the roads, uh, but definitely some of the higher elevations there. Very busy across the United States. Not only are we seeing our activity up here in the northwest, but check this out. We've had severe thunderstorms down in Texas. We've had some heavy snowfall up towards areas of Minnesota and everything in between and seeing some snow too. So it's just been a busy day. I'll take you to Highway uh, 20 there at Sandy Ann Pass. As you can see, it's a little snowed over there. And this is one of the passes that could collect a couple more inches tonight. Uh, and that goes for the Willamette Pass as well. This has been kind of quiet, but you can see the temperature there, not even close to freezing. It's at 27, 28 degrees there. And so anything that falls down is going to be coming down as snowfall. Ski report, we've had three inches at Timberline, Meadows two inches, Ski Bowl one and Bachelor two, more on the way. Temperatures right now in the mid 40s for just about everyone. So yeah, maybe a heavier jacket if you're about to step out. 46 for PDX and 41 degrees coming out of Happy Valley. That chance of rain continues over the next couple of hours, as I've mentioned. It does slow down a bit, though, on Thursday before we have maybe a couple more hiccups there where we have just a couple isolated or scattered showers as we go into our Friday. And I'll show you where uh, in just one second. Here's 4 p.m. here, so we're a little bit beyond that, but uh, we get into the next couple of hours. We'll keep that rain and that moisture in place. Notice still the snowfall likely for the Cascades, the Blue Mountains, everything kind of in between. And then uh, some drier slots there off to the west. I think on Thursday it's going to be pretty dry, especially after the morning hours. It's not going to be much to really start triggering up any showers, but we'll keep a small chance in there for tomorrow as well. And likely some sun breaks too. It'll probably cool down uh, pretty quick for Central Oregon tomorrow. Okay, here's Friday morning. We have our next uh, chance for some rain, but it's not going to impact the whole state. It's likely just going to hold to the northwest. So. Uh, anywhere down towards the south will probably stay dry. That could even mean Salem. And then again on Saturday, as we just kind of clip the bottom edge of this system here, and that could bring in a chance for some rain again uh, Saturday night, which that should probably reach everybody. All right, seven day forecast 45 on Friday, 49 on Saturday. Still dry New Year's Eve. Temperatures in the mid 40s. Mm, okay, and speaking of New Year's Eve, now that Christmas is done and over, right. we are Let's moving get on. Get it out of here. It's less than